A Stanford professor added a pretty cool line to her resume today. Nobel Prize winner. In fact, her award-winning research could dramatically change how we treat cancer. NBC Bears Ian Cull had a chat with the newest Nobel winner. Stanford professor Carolyn Bertozzi's phone started ringing at 1.53 this morning. It was a member of the Nobel Prize Committee. Said you have um, you have just under one hour before the, the announcement goes live on the live stream. So enjoy the last hour of your previous life because <laughs> then it will start your new life. From then on, it's been hours of interviews and the Q and A with the Royal Swedish Academy of Sciences that awards the prize. Congratulations uh, for receiving the Nobel Prize in Chemistry. It's extraordinary. I mean, it's it's surreal. Bertozzi is one of three Nobel Prize winners in chemistry this year, and she is credited for inventing a new type of chemistry called click in bioorthogonal chemistry. It's used in labs worldwide and may be key in fighting cancer. These two chemicals, the bioorthogonal chemicals, are very carefully engineered to ignore every other chemical and find each other across a crowded room and form a bond. Now, this is this is a superpower. A type of precision medicine that can be used to kill cancerous cells without affecting the rest of the body. Bertozzi earned her doctorate from UC Berkeley and did postdoctoral work at UCSF. Her first call today was to her dad. He was a physicist at MIT. He encouraged my sisters and I to, you know, think about science as a possible career choice. I think today was absolutely, you know, a highlight of his 91-year-old life. And the recognition going beyond the family and field, Tom Morello, the famed guitarist from Rage Against the Machine, tweeting out that Carolyn is his former bandmate at Harvard, saying we won the Ivy League Battle of the Bands in 86 with our rockin' group Board of Education, with her on the keyboards and me in the spandex. And then, of course, after college, Tom, with his in immense talent, went off and became a successful professional musician, whereas I, with my lesser talent, made the wise decision, looking ever wiser by the minute, <laughs> of going into chemistry. And it certainly paid off. Ian Cole, NBC Bay Area News.